When I started in this band, I was a kid. Everything about being a kid is hard. And the band is the thing that saves you from that. To work together with the same guys for four decades, you can't beat that, you can't repeat that. Rush Time Stand Still follows one of Canada's most iconic bands as they embark on their sold-out final tour. Alan Weinrib joins us this morning. He's the film's producer and as well he has a close connection with Rush and that is with Getty Lee, your Getty Lee's brother. Um, so it was the R40 tour is the yes. one that you went through, uh, the 40th anniversary mm -hmm. tour. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about the tour itself be and having the access that you did. Well, it was a 35 city tour, for, so for them it was a very short tour, so there wasn't, you know, a lot of time really to cover things. And when, you know, in the early part of sort of the evolution of what the tour would be, you know, myself and Dale Hesler, we work as also as part of the, the tour's creative team. So, you know, we come up with the films that run in the background and Dale designs, you know, the, the, the set or the stage design that's going on. So, you know, we, we had a, an inkling that this might be the last time around, so, you know, we kind of convinced the man to let us put a cameraman on the tour with them. So we embedded uh, an individual, Miller, who was our field director, and, and he toured with the band. So he was there for, for every show, interviewing fans and getting as many behind the scenes, you know, aspects of the tour as we could. So that way, you know, we just had this record. You know, when you start on these things, kind of building a documentary, you don't really know where it's going to go. You kind of have to gather material. And, and that was kind of the, at least the base that we had to work with. You've worked with many Canadian musicians. You're not new to uh, doing music videos. It's, this is your brother. Um, <laughs> you know, uh, did you realize how big of the fan support your brother's band has? We, oh yeah, we always know when we when we sit down and devise the tours. It's you know we always come back to all oh, the fans will love that. You know because we know there's this rabid base out there, and we know how important it is. So that. You know, that's what we wanted it to capture. You know, the, the, there's already been a documentary on the band. It covers their history that it, they did an awesome job doing that. So this was really about about the present and about, you know, a bit of the lineage of the band's touring history. It wasn't talked a lot about in the, in the other docs. So we figured we wanted to you know, kind of cover that territory, but really, you know, kind of pay a bit of an homage to the fans because, you know, they're, they're the ones that, you know, kind of make this all happen. So the fans themselves going to see this when it's going to be coming out on as it's Thursday this week. Yeah. Um, what's going to make it great for them? Well, I think you know they're going to learn a little bit more about the band. It's you know, as we we did films for the tours, you know, we always found the ones that were most successful were the ones that incorporated the band in them, you know, where we have them playing themselves or playing characters. So I think I think the fans are gonna enjoy that. I think, you know, just getting to see a lot of the behind the scenes stuff. You know, um, you know, we, we present uh, an aspect of the Los Angeles show. We do, you know, we're covering sound check at that point in time. Not a lot of bands get to see, you know, what happens in sound check and how it all goes down. So I think th there's lots for fans to dive just in the course of uh, this 90 minute piece. Uh, yeah, it'll be for sale on DVD and there's going to be something unique for those buying the DVD as well as in theaters. Yep. There's even some extras as well. Yeah, yeah, in the theater there's a whole pre-roll show that is unique to the theaters. It'll only be seen there uh, called The Salute to Kings where they've interviewed a whole bunch of, you know, Gene Simmons and Taylor Hawkins and a few others are, are interviewed in terms of what the band, you know, means to them. And then the, the DVD itself has, you know, a concert that we've never released before. So, uh, you know, there's, I think, 10 tracks from that show that, you know, fans will have not had on TV before. So you think Eddie says that you did a good job? Yeah, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> it's more important what my mother said. Really. Exactly, for sure. Rush Time Stand Sales is in theaters on tomorrow night. Head to Breakfast Television for more information. All the information about the DVD is there as well. Thanks for coming in this morning. Yeah, it's a pleasure. pleasure meeting you. Thank you. I have lots more to come.